So welcome back to another gameplay video and we're still playing with Sporting KC. We are in Division 1. We got our 18 game winning streak broken in the previous match. We lost 6-2 against Hamburg. So let's jump straight into it. We're going to play the final match with Sporting KC. 4-3-3 holding with a... Uh, Slow build up possession game with a lot of width. Face Basil. Is it Basil? Basil, Basil, Basel. to midfield. I have no idea what's going on here. Defense is way out of position, way passive. Midfield is totally a wall. Radoya is not quick enough. We're not able to penetrate the area with Radoya there. He comes on a very nice run, he got the angle and everything, but he's not able to penetrate quickly enough. Some difficult stuff for no good reason at all. Nice. through here. So I think we, we have actually forgotten a little bit about the left winger, Saloy. And his skill set because it looked pretty good when we take when we looked at the available players before the first match. Saloy looked very very good. He can probably do a lot more than he has been doing this far. Okay. 
A nice press. Very nice. Let's go. Let's see if we can create something. Pulido in behind, maybe? Come on. Oh, almost. We almost had it. Radoya! No! We finally get the acceleration boost for like a little bit at least. And then the finish is what the hell? Oh man, come on, press. Tackle. Fuck, oh, Susie is burnt. It's so easy, man. It's. <laughs> You know what I mean? It's just speed bursting and I'm not defending properly. <sighs> Gets too much space and time. Look here, bro. Wow, Walter, nice. Run. Nothing I can do on that one. We're not getting any press on the passer. He has all the time in the world to just hit that three ball and bam. Is he offside? For real? How can you be offside there, man? 10 football IQ, bro. I'm not getting any press. Look at all the space time is getting. There we go. Come on. Do we have enough time? I think the most annoying thing about this score is the way he scored goals. It's almost like he's no he's made no effort. You know what I mean? He's just he's gotten space. And he's just passing and running straight up the middle.
Pass this one. Okay, let's go. Oh, straight up the goalie, man. Really. Ay ay ay. Kinda man. Shup shup bam. Yeah, this is a very nice attack. Come on. He's getting like... It's a nice attack and everything, but... The problem we've had the entire match is basically my midfield is nowhere to be found in defense. So he's getting the, the rebound there without any kind of press on him. Ideally, one of my defenders would have been there to try to get the rebound. There's no way. No way we missed that chance. way Russell misses that chance man left foot from there perfect angle everything Oh, 
How high ranked is Basel really? Is it? I'm gonna guess maybe not, f probably not four star. It's gonna be three and a half star at least. Have enemy <coughs> defense. Oh, it's really bad. Horrible. Oof, 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 man. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> he just fuck you bro Defense, it has been extremely solid though. Very nice defense from him. Oh, mosquito. Wow, mosquito bit me. I have to say, very disappointing. I mean, of course, it's disappointing when you come off like an 18 win streak and you lose first, you lose 6 to 2, and then you lose 5 to 2. First. Was it 6-2 to two again? But maybe it just exposes the team, you know what I mean? I, I try to defend as good as I can. I, I'm pretty, I would say I was defending the same way I was defending against... Uh, uh, I mean, I was defending the same way I was defending with these other teams I've been using, right? So... Maybe just that it's the defenders not good enough. It's plain and simple. The defense on this team is not good enough. This is this is what I mean. He dribbles like one defender and no one else is close being like a second defender. This was a very nice goal as well. No one able to to chase him or to try to mark him down there so easy goal for him and yeah, we hit the crossbar here on uh, three two, wasn't it? And then he got the re yeah, he got the rebound on this one, and yeah, that was it, pretty much. Yeah. So I guess the six two result doesn't entirely reflect the the flow of the game of the match but overall i mean he was good and basel are i'm gonna guess basel are three and a half star or they they might be three star as well but still it is better than sporting kc overall two and a half uh two and a half stars so 
yeah, we end the Sporting KC gameplay with a couple of huge losses. And to summarize, I mean, they have some good players, definitely. I would say Alan Pulido, although he should be like one of the better players here. It didn't feel like he was, and that might be because of the tactics. Maybe the tactics weren't suited for him or and his playstyle. I don't feel like we got we got that much out of these uh, good forwards we had there. Pulido was on paper very good. Saloy on paper very good. But with this possession slow build-up thing they have going here, I think this would probably be a more effective uh, team to play maybe direct passing with them. So we can get uh, their speed and dribbling ability like in behind trying to challenge the, uh, the fullbacks a, a bit more. And also having Williams as a starting right winger and also somehow get Kinda into the starting 11, maybe be in, instead of Radoya maybe. And then you will have like a very nice attacking team. But the defense might be too weak still. I don't know. Something about the defense was a little bit off. So, thanks for watching. The next gameplay is gonna be Toronto FC. And do we still have a, a shot at a title? Yeah. We can still get the title. We need 8 points. Which basically means we need to win 3 straight with Toronto. So that's gonna be the next 3 videos. Take care, thanks for watching, I will see you guys.